this is out of the box. You saw I just loaded that in from 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 the Autodesk um, Revit Families Cloud thing. <laughs> and now I'm just going to make sure that it's on both sides of the truss, and I'm going to copy that along there. And so just to give the idea, this is what we're trying to do. We're trying to do some sort of a truss. We want to have some sort of steel showing, um, and then we want it to, to multiply along the, the, uh, the space uh, on the inside. So that's all I'm doing here is just aligning the work planes, uh, taking it, copying it to the other area. And then now I've got myself a little group that I can make of truss and plate all together. And then I can take that along uh, the whole rest of the, the space. So I just made a group out of it. I can use an array. I can copy the group depending on how, I, how you want to do it. I think here I'm copying the group mainly because I wanted a specific uh, spacing within the, the larger space. But um, again, this is schematic design. So we just want this to be there. Just adjusting the spacing here. Now you can see we've got our truss. All right, y'all. So there we have it. Episode two of the Modern Barn series.